Surf's up, dudes. We got Raging Surf today. All right, guys, this is the newest Japanese set, which not too many people are talking about. That is because Scarlet and Violet 151 is like taking all of the attention. They pretty much came out the exact same date, which was September 22nd. But today we are going to show Raging Surf some love. It's okay, you'll be getting some attention today. We are going to open this entire booster box from the new Japanese set. So guys, let's get right into it. Now, let me just say, I have been super excited to open in this thing but like i mentioned 151 has just came out a lot of products coming out for 151 so i haven't gotten around to opening this thing but just take a look at this box super cool cover i love how they have the terra garchomp the jirachi gold dango cheese stick and uh tapu coco groudon all up in the front there i think they picked a pretty cool lineup of pokemon so let's go ahead and crack this thing open and they also picked a pretty cool art on the box itself. It's got like a swirl of water, hence the name Raging Surf. So let's take a look here at our booster box. And I believe this one brings 30 packs. Uh, I think it's like five cards per pack. So let's go ahead and, oh, this is so satisfying. This is my favorite part, I think. Ah, there we go. I don't know what it is, uh, like I'm having more fun opening this than I've been doing with 151. I don't know, call me weird. Uh, you know, I'm probably gonna get a few hate comments, but I just prefer this right now. I don't know what it is. Japanese just always has a spot for me. Let's see. I mean, also, cause maybe I haven't been getting too lucky with 151. It's been pretty disappointing with the hits. All right, but let's see. We got 30 packs. They all have this artwork. It's the same as the cover of the box. And just a lot of colors on this set. I like how they did that blue and white uh, just throughout the box and throughout these packs. So with these, I believe it's one from the back. Let's see what we got. There's a rare candy. Scraggy. Oh, that's a cute good bite. And Cyclizar. Okay, so I guess with these, you're not even guaranteed any hollow, anything like that. So let's see. I don't know if it's better to have 20 packs with more cards in it or just these 30 uh, packs that bring five cards per pack I don't know which is better uh, I don't know if any of these have to do with the hit rate oh wow look at this that is a crazy illustration rare it looks so realistic look at that we got a oh look at that Jirachi that's pretty sick I don't know if Jirachi has any EX cards or any illustration rare in this set. I have not looked at this set that much. All I know is that there's a crazy cool Groudon that comes in here. He's like standing on a field and just looks really badass. I know the Gimme Ghoul and Gold Dango that come in here. Um, pretty cool artwork. They just look very uh, 3D. And of course, we got the Gold Guard Chomp. And I think this card has a pretty cool illustration rare, the Mantike. These are actually pretty fast to go through. That's what I kind of like about this. Oh, we got Larry. Fampy. Oof. Domfan. Goodbye. Hauntor. Oh, that's a pretty cool Hauntor. Almost looks a little cartoonish. Oh, let's go. No way. We got the Garchomp EX. The full art, that is sick. Take a look at this card. Wow, look at that hollow finish. It looks very bright. Let's see, hopefully we can get a lot here today. Here is an energy, artillery, Chimico, ghastly. Oh man, look at that Absol. Really enjoying the artwork on even the common cards in this set. Okay, wow, look at that Gengar, that's pretty sick. I like a lot of these artworks, this is awesome. Look at that snow run. We've got Gimmigool. Ooh, okay, we got a Tapu Coco EX. So I'm getting pretty pretty decent hits. Uh, we got three, yeah, three hits so far. I think I'm almost like 10 packs in, if not 10 packs in. Oh, there's a Minum and Puzzle, that's right. Forgot about those, those are pretty cool too. Oh, look at that Groudon, he looks mean. I actually ended up buying this set for $95 at a car shop, but I think you could get it online. I've seen them for as low as 70 bucks per booster box. So I think this might be a set that's slept on right now. Mostly because 151 is out. Uh, not too many people are paying attention to this set. But I think it's, uh, okay, wow. We got a Hoopa EX and this is the Terra one. It's got like texture here. 
yeah, whenever you see like all the lines going in, these are usually textured. So I feel this set might be underrated right now. Cause I mean 70 bucks and I feel like a lot of the cards in this set are probably gonna have a higher value. I had to bite this one. This one was a pain to open. I believe the most expensive card, of course it's a trainer card. Usually with Japanese sets it's trainer cards, but it's the parasol lady. Um, you know, the umbrella lady, she's just like holding her umbrella. Oh, there she is. Speaking of the devil. But uh, with the special illustration rare, she's like looking up and it's like raining. So it's a really nice card. Uh, I could see why it's worth that much. Got Excalibur here. All right, let's see. It's one from the back. Look at that Lapras. I might end up picking up another booster box. Uh, just because I kind of want to get like the grout on and all those other illustration rares. There's a lot of really nice cards in here. I mean, considering I don't pull something crazy here, I'll probably end up picking up another one. And let me know what you guys think. Have you gotten this set? Is this something uh, you're looking forward to open or is all your attention just on 151 right now? But uh, yeah, hopefully you guys can, uh, you know, take a look at this video, get a good idea of what comes in this set, the pull rates. And uh, if you guys do get this set, let me know in the comments what you get. Uh, any pulls you've gotten, I would love to know. Let's see. Got a Gligar, Thiebel, and Cyclizar. I have a bunch of Japanese bulk. Uh, not as much as English, of course, but I don't even know what to do with it because car shops don't even take it. Uh, who knows? So I, I gotta figure out. Oh! No way! We got the ground on! Oh my god, I can't believe we got the ground on. That is sick! Wow, I forgot how awesome this card was. I haven't looked at it for a while. It's got two volcanoes back here. Take a look at that. That is just sick. Oh my god. I can't even ask for anything more. We got like, uh, I like that guard chump a lot. We got the grout on. And I think those are the, probably the two cards that I mostly wanted to get. Let's see, I'm satisfied already, but let's keep going. Let's see what else we can get from Raging Surf. I think I'm more than likely going to end up picking up another one of these sets. Let's see, we've got the Mino. I think we might be guaranteed a Hyper Rare in this, so let's see. Hopefully I could get that Garchomp. I think I think I do prefer the Garchomp over the Goldengo. Um, I'm just, I prefer like, you know, big scary Pokemon like Dragons and all that, Rayquaza, all those. Instead of, you know, Goldengo, it's just it's like a gold cheese stick. No, you know who it reminds me of? Uh, he actually reminds me of the cinnamon stick from Apple Jacks, which is a great cereal, but he looks so much like the dude from Apple Jacks. <laughs> oh, what do we got here? Okay, speaking of the devil again, we got Goldengo EX, and this is a pretty cool EX card. I like how there's like gold coins pretty much flying at you. All right, so we got the Apple Jacks cinnamon stick, which I think he's Jamaican. Yeah, they made him like Jamaican, which is hilarious actually. Let's see, we got Goodbye, Ghastly, and a Lantern. Oh, what a great set to open. I'm always so glad to be sharing, you know, these moments with you guys, uh, opening these up uh, while recording. It's just awesome. It's It feels so great. We got a White Vettel. Yeah, guys, but with 151, I've been super unlucky, so I think it's so refreshing to get <laughs> some decent hits now. Uh, with 151, I've opened up a good amount of products in ETB, the Zapdos, and uh, Alakazam box, and I've opened up a few of the mini tins, and no luck, I've only gotten two full art cards, and I've only been able to get one illustration rare, which is super frustrating, and the rest, and the rest has just been like EX cards. So it's, it's a nice change of pace to be actually getting some hits. And uh, let's see what else we could get in here. I have a feeling like we could get something else in the six, seven packs we have left here. Let's see what we got. Look at that Flamigo. Ooh, Chimico. Absol. Five packs, including this one. Let's see, can we finish with another hit? Fingers crossed, guys, wish me some luck. And again, would like to take this moment to say thank you to all my subscribers and all the love and support. 
Also guys, let me know in the comments what you think of this set. Is this something you want to pick up or maybe just pass on? I know it's it's tough. There's so many sets that are coming out. It's crazy, 151 came out and just like in a month, we're going to get Paradox Rift. Ooh, okay. We got a Frost Glass EX, very cool. And he turned into a grass type. So there's normally an ice type. I know the Terra changes its type, so that's cool. Turns into a grass. I think that'll throw a lot of people off when battling it. Two packs left. Do we get a hyper rare? That's the question. I want to know if you're guaranteed a hyper rare or not. Oh, no way. That is sick. We got the mine. <laughs> is he crying? So he looks like he's like crying. There's like some guy like distress in the background. Got some good looking pizza there. So this is a pretty cool illustration rare. Very nice. All right, so there's our last pack of the day. If the hyper rare is not in here, then I guess we're not guaranteed a hyper rare. Let's hope for the best. Come on, what do we got? Do we have anything? We do not. So here are the hits from Raging Surf. Let's see, we got a Minun, Frost Glass, Gold Dango, the sick Groudon, I love this dude. We got the Hoopa, Tapu Coco, and there is the Garchomp, full art. And what was the last one? Oh yeah, sick illustration rare. Let's go. All right, people, that's it for Raging Surf. This was an awesome set to open. Let me know what you think about it in the comments. And also let me know if there's a set you guys might pick up. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, subscribe. Also, check out my other videos here. Binge watch them. And I'll see you guys later.